you bubble gum kick ass. I got no bubble gum, so just gonna kick some ass. All the way. You like to party? I like to party. To me, fighting, not just the, the, the personal task, it's just raw. I mean, it's, it's me versus one other person. There's nothing else, just me and him and my skills versus his skills. To me, I don't think there's any a better form of competition. Going to the weigh-ins with everyone in our 2014 rickshaw, AKA the PTS, Bangkok Transit System. Stay strong. Stay strong. I have never done nothing in my life that has been consistent and this is the one thing that I've been at and I love it probably today more than when I first started. The first time my entire life knew that this is exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. I wouldn't want it any other way. I'm just living that samurai life. Thirsty? A little bit. Real G's don't get thirsty though. Everyone's on weight. Emlo is Emlo. Shadow boxing on the way here. <laughs> Having a meltdown as usual, but it's all good. That's how he works. Alex Shields is on weight. Then cool, calm, and collective. Bad. Both. He's down. Okay, Mike. See that, huh? You got more. As my vision of what, like, if I was coming to America from America to fight in Bangkok for the first time, this is a real life '80s '90s action movie. Phuket from America. Alex Shield! Alex, take a picture of the cheeky ladies next. Yes, you have. Don't mind if I do. You gotta do that before you square up to your man. Get all sexually confused with naked men and hot women. This is gonna be fun tomorrow. At their natural place. Emilio! There's a reason this is the uh, first fight on the uh, main card. It's because these two are going to kill each other. It's going to be amazing. Okay, great guys. When I was young, I had some plan in my life. I had some goals. I had some dreams. And I find all of my dreams in fighter and fight away and I'm gonna just keep going and keep going and keep going. This could be the fight of the night. What's it taste like? Like heaven on earth. Mm. Never knew fruit. It tastes as good. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> How is it? Amazing. Best one I've ever had. Martial arts for me is uh, it's just a way to really just be able to test myself. It's just that warrior spirit, you know, for me it's more like a lifestyle. You know, it's about training and just trying to get better, you know, honestly. Every day I'm just trying to get a little bit better than I was yesterday and, and enhance my skill set, you know, and then see how far I can actually take it. My goal is to train every day, you know, hopefully to the day I die. Even just the highs before it, you know, you're scared, then you're happy and you're confident and then you're nervous and all these emotions. There's nothing better than that. And another part of, of competing that, that I think is the best is, is having your team around you. That, so having that camaraderie is probably the best part about fighting. I just feel like I'm surrounded by uh, world champions in every aspect of the game, and it just it gives me a lot of, uh, a lot of confidence.
ladies and gentlemen. What I feel when I walk in the cage, that's the best feel ever, you know. I really love it. I love it. When I walk into the cage, that's me. That's my time. The lights are on. They're introducing you. There's, there's no other ifs, ands, or buts. You can't turn around. Your hands are wrapped. Your mouthpiece is in. So when I walk into the cage, that's my time. I feel like I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be. Winning makes it all worth it. it makes the, the pain of the weight cut, the pain of the training, the pain of sparring and eating healthy, and the highs and the lows, winning makes it worth it. Wow, I was really happy. You know, that night was one of the, my best night in my life. Really, really, really. The best part about competing is, is just the high you get from fighting. You know, I was talking about those those highs and the lows and then winning makes it worth it. That, that high you get when you're when it's finally over and the ref stops it and he raises your hand, there's no better feeling than that. I've never experienced anything like that in anything I've done. Got a chili dog, got a knockout, all good, I'll have you.